Hi, I'm Mike Chapman, and I'm the founder and operator of Chaps Chow Rescue in Atlanta. I've been rescuing chows for 40 years. We averaged 45 chows a year that came out of animal control that were gonna get killed if they didn't get out of there. We still take in every child that we feel like we can help. Like most rescues, we're always short of foster homes. Every child we save is really something we think is wonderful and they all deserve wonderful loving homes and that's our goal. This is BB, he's one of our rescues and I flunked fostering. After he got here, I fell in love and I think he fell in love with me and we decided we'd make a good pair. BB, through no fault of his own, was abandoned in Los Angeles. The owner was met at the airplane by an ambulance and taken immediately to the emergency room. And the wonderful people at United Airlines advertised that they would fly him anywhere in the United States to a great home. And Chaps Chow stepped up and said, we'll take him. We also have a policy, we will take back any child if for some reason the family can't look after the dog anymore. I think that's a very important part of rescuing is that once you rescue that dog, you're responsible for that dog's life for the rest of its life. And so we take that, you know, very seriously. We have a Facebook page and we list our dogs there. We do have a donation site if anybody wants to make a donation. So we stepped up for a lot of dogs when we can, but that's why donations are real helpful. If you have chows or know the breed very well, you know they don't do well in animal control. Chow chows like to be in control, and we have pulled many a chow out of a situation like that that they were saying, well, we were thinking about putting him down. He or she is aggressive. And by the time they got in the car, we'd bring them home and they were the most loving dogs. It's, it's situational, mostly. We hope you'll follow up with us on Facebook, Chaps Chow Rescue. We would, of course, prefer fosters in the Atlanta, Georgia area, and we look forward to hearing from you.